What's up, everybody? Jason here for jazbeescasebreaks.com. <coughs> Excuse me. We have a 2019 Panini Prism Football 10 Box Mega Box Break Random Teams Number One Sellout, where we're giving away a free spot for being an early bird. And how to get entered to get a free spot is all you have to do is take one of the first 20 spots. So we'll take the first 20 customer names that bought in, randomize them, and the top name will win a free spot in this break here. Just remember, no veteran commons will ship out of here. Everybody gets a random team in the NFL. So for the dice roller here, uh, is going to be for the early bird randomizer, the randomizer for the names, and the teams. So let's roll the dice, and we got ourselves a three and a four for seven times. Number one for the early bird gets a free spot. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Aaron P, congratulations, free spot right there. There's early bird, and let's go seven times down here as well. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Rhea down to John. Seven times here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Falcons down to the Rams. So real with the Falcons, Jay with the Ravens, Karen with the Jets, Nick with the Browns, Matt with the 49ers, David with the Giants, Benjamin with the Cowboys, Kenneth with the Dolphins, Jose with the uh, Bucks, <coughs> Darren with the Chiefs, Philip with the Texans, Patrick with the Vikings, Benjamin with the Cardinals, Jay with the Broncos, Barry with the Seahawks, Aaron, you got Raiders, your free spot, and the spot you paid for. Bucks, Ryan, you have the Patriots, last ball module, Nick with the Saints, Travis with the Panthers, Corey with the Bears, and my Eagles, Will with the football team of Washington. <coughs> Christian with the Steelers, Sean with the Chargers, Joshua with the Bills, Nicholas with the Colts, Travis with the Bengals, Corey with the Lions, Cohen with the Titans, Aaron, P with the Jaguars, and John with the Los Angeles Rams. Anybody want to trade? Trade window is open. Nice, Matt. Hey, the odds are, even though it's 1 in 32 chance, it's still, still hard to hit <laughs> your team. So, hey, man, well, there you go. Actually, I think <coughs> I'm going to turn on Nick Cam and I'm going to actually start ripping some of these mega boxes just so that way we can get some of this stuff rolling. Josh was saying, Bills for trade. I'll give it a minute. If not, stick with what you got, guys. <laughs> Is that right, Juan? Damn. Well, depending on the year, 2019 is not bad. It's not bad. Alright guys, sorry, I'm going to close the tray window. Stick with what you got.
Oh, no, yeah, TWC, instead of writing it all out. Oh, wait, well, I'm tripping out right now. I was like, what? That's <laughs> all good, man. Yeah. All good. Yeah, I don't remember when we started doing TWC. I don't know if it was me or Joe that did it. Might have been Joe. We used to actually just put, like, trade one of the clothes written all, all out. And we're just like... Why waste time and just fit a little acronym for it, right? Alright, so the Mega Box exclusive are the gold lasers, right? Or, I want to say. Or is it the b blue, or is it the green, green pris, or the neon green? Say it's a neon green, that's why Nick posted up that photo. Alright, guys, so after this, we'll do another quick filler break and then flawless basketball. It is, right, Ryan? Yeah, I mean, Clippers. Honestly, guys, I didn't even know the Clippers are playing this early today. And Denver somehow forcing a, yet another Game 7 from being down 3-1. Denver right now is just playing with all heart and just don't want to go home just yet. While the Clippers should have put it away. Clippers, what if they don't play the Lakers in the Western Conference Finals? Alright, here are the first five boxes, guys. Good luck. Alexander Matheson. We got Dexter Williams. Ooh, very nice. I know, right? <laughs> Green Bay Packers. Actually, I don't even think I showed you guys the final, final printout. 
And with the Packers, though. Devin Singletary. Ed Oliver. And DeAndre Baker. Will Greer. Harris Campbell. Will Brady. Ooh, Redemption. Singletary. Eddie Mahomes, Fireworks. Hassan Reddick, Will Greer. There's Ken That's like the same idea. This is the identical box. Josh Allen, though. Oh, yeah, Ryan, you told me that on uh, on, on set, uh, Friday morning, I believe, right? You thought it was like, I think, uh, well, the last time I think you told me you checked was it was like a $4,000 card, right? Now it's like at least twelve. That's that's a nice way to check on some stuff, right? Moving around. You're like, oh, I got this right here. Huh, I wonder what it's worth now. Yeah, no, that's awesome, man. I must have been hiding somewhere. <laughs> Rookie autographs, prism, neon green, card number three, twenty-two, and it's Gardner Minshew. Wow, he had a great game today for the Jaguars. That's going to Aaron. There you go, a little redemp. Next mega box. And Joe Juan Williams autograph for the Patriots going to Ryan Shackleton. Last spot mojo. Nick Bosa for the 49ers. Scary Terry McLaren. A John Elway Silver. That's nice. Broncos going to J. And a Zach Allen for the Cardinals. Going to Benjamin. DK Metcalf. Hakeem Butler. Another one for the Cardinals and Benjamin. Philip Lindsay for the Broncos silver. Howard for the Bucks.
All right, last box here, then we'll go to the next five. And a Paris Campbell for the Colts on Nicholas. Devin Singletary. Nick Chubb. I don't think, I mean, there could be, I think that I've seen color before, Ryan, but I don't think these neon green prisms are numbered. It's week one, Ryan. It's week one, man. Give it some time to develop. Well, Burl doing well is good for the hobby. On. That's for sure.
Alright. Two more boxes, guys. Again, I believe Nick posted up another 10 boxes, so... I'll just run one back a little later. So after this, remember a quick pack break to unlock the lock two spots and flawless random hit. Then after that, like I said, the basketball mixer has one filler left plus five spots straight up for basketball. Mosaic is moving like crazy. Hobby edition. Um, Well, another reason, Aaron, I don't think the Eagles did so well is Miles didn't play today. I guess his hamstring injury kept him out today. I thought he was going to play because he was practicing all week, but maybe, maybe, uh, maybe they don't want to risk it out there. Because I know when he comes back, he's going to be the, <laughs> he's going to have the playbook opened up for that guy. Yeah, we have Miles out. We have Lane Johnson, our lineman. Oh, well. Dillard, our left tackle, that was supposed to start out for the year. Brooks out for the year. A lot of big time offensive starters were out for the out for this game. All right. Will Greer. And Naheem Hines. I think he had a touchdown run today. Jalen Ferguson. Well, I mean, like I said, I, I, I think the line held up very good until halftime. <laughs> It wasn't until after halftime that everything just just fell apart. And obviously, the eight or nine sacks that Wentz got, think about it, nine sacks or eight or nine sacks in a game, that's ridiculous. Which probably caused Wentz to try to force it, try to extend the play. And as you can see, that's probably why. That's probably why it would happen, you know? That's Rodney Anderson. A lot of Paris Campbell in these boxes, man. Damian Harris. Silver Zach Ertz. He also had a crucial drop on a fourth down. Montgomery, Tim Brown. Yeah, I mean, that's that's good, but he's also holding on to the ball too much, Ryan. I think what he needs to learn to do more is throw away the ball. Ty Johnson. Look to fight another down. I'm okay with him taking the sack and not trying to force things like that, but he also needs to just throw away the ball. There's times where I think he can easily avoid it if he just decides to throw it away. Sanders. Tyler Murray, look at that run. Jesus. But if there's one positive, though, is that Jalen Rieger's in the ball. Once hit him on a deep 55 yard pass and just missed him. Just missed Rieger on like a 75 yard touchdown pass. Like, man. Rigor was like right there. Once just barely overthrew him. 
like I said, that's just no having no preseason, nothing like that. It's gonna be kind of hard for rookies and them to, you know, to get in sync. So it's probably gonna take the Eagles a couple games, probably. Uh, yeah, Paul, we'll have some probably available for personals a little later tonight. I think we'll start in the stream like around five, five or so. So just check back on IG soon. You should get. I think if you follow us, you also get a notification if you have them turned on. I don't think we have any hobby left, Paul, but I think we still have some choice. Tyree Jackson. Ricky Seals Jones. Keeps going down, Paul? I have it, I always have it opened here. It doesn't look like it's dropped for me. So maybe close the web browser, close your app, and retry it again. Uh, but more likely than not, it's always... Um, it's always the customer or the person watching because, you know, maybe... I mean, I know our internet speed is really, really strong here. You know, we're connected straight up hardwire, but... Sometimes it's always just a connection when it comes from the phone, the tablet, or the home Wi-Fi. But I'll take a look at it, though. I'm, I'm, like I said, I have my screen open right here to my left. And it doesn't look like it's freezing so much or dropping. So most likely it might be on your end. But if anybody else experiences anything like that, let me know. Last box, guys. John Brown. And Lonnie Johnson Jr. Yeah, I don't know if we'll have any hobby band because I know we sold out a lot of those. But if not, we'll have choice, though, at least. But maybe look out. Look at the website, too. Alrighty guys, and there you go. That was the break, so no crazy huge auto here. Or huge rookie neon prism green, so hey. Chance to potentially get some nice stuff in the next ten boxes. So check it out guys. I don't know what the prediction would be, Aaron, but go Rams. <laughs> never, never, never that other team. But I could also see it being a, a high-scoring game, but a super low-scoring game, because I think both defenses are pretty strong. I don't see a blowout for either one of those teams. I, I think it's going to be close. High scoring or low scoring. So here you go. Here's the autographs, guys. I guess Gardner Minshew was pretty good. There you go, guys. Appreciate it. JaspiesCaseBreaks.com.